This video is made possible thanks to the pump station and nurturery. Come visit us at 2727 Main Street in Santa Monica, California. You can also visit our website, pumpstation.com. This is Adam, the certified car seat technician with the pump station and nurturery in infant toddler youth. And we're gonna show you how to do a baseless installation for the Nuna Pippa infant car seats. Now, anytime you're gonna do baseless, you need to make sure your child is buckled in properly first. You're gonna set them down in the back seat. The seat belt is gonna go over the car seat. We're gonna buckle in. After you buckle in, you're gonna grab your lap belt and just go under the tab here. Now the seat belt doesn't have to go completely inside. This is just a path to let you know where the lap belt should be. All right. Now your shoulder belt has two options. The first option is if the seat belt is not long enough to go around the back of the car seat, you're just gonna let it go straight back up to the vehicle. The second option is if the seat belt is long enough, you can do what's called the European path, where the shoulder belt goes around the back. There is a belt path for the seat belt that the shoulder belt can slide into. And there we go. Once you figure out what type of shoulder belt you have, the shorter or the European possibility, the next step is the most important. We have to make sure we lock the seat belt. Grab the shoulder, pull it all the way out as far as it can go. Now when you let it retract, you're gonna hear like a ratcheting sound. That sound is letting you know that the seat belt is now in locking mode. Now, if you've just yanked the seat belt and it's locked and you haven't heard the ratcheting sound, that just means that it's locked temporarily. So you have to make sure you pull it all the way out and you hear the ratcheting sound. Once we've switched the seatbelt to locking mode, we can begin to tighten it. So grab the shoulder belt, push down on the car seat, and as you're pushing down, you wanna pull the seatbelt toward the shoulder. So you, you're pulling it away from the buckle, essentially, away from the car seat. So I'm pushing down to get it snug. I'm pulling on the seatbelt to tighten it. And all of the slack I'm pulling, I want to make sure we feed it into the car so it continues to lock. The way to know this is tight enough is with one hand, you're going to grab it from either side of the car seat, grab it as close to the belt path as possible, and all you're looking for is that inch of movement. If the car seat does not move more than an inch from side to side or front to back, then you know it's tight enough. Never test it from the top of the car seat. Nothing is attached back here, so it's going to be able to wobble and shake. That's just going to happen. So remember, only test it from the belt path where it's being connected to the vehicle. The next thing we got to do, or the last thing we got to do, is make sure that the baby is sitting at the right angle. So on both sides of the car seat, there's going to be a blue line. On some, it might be red. But you have to make sure that the blue line is level with the ground. That's how you know the baby's at the right position. If it's not level, grab it from the front and the back and just kind of reposition it a little bit. Retighten the seatbelt if necessary. But once you've got it snug and the angle at the right position, then you know that the car seat is installed correctly. When you're ready to get the child out of the vehicle, you're gonna unbuckle the seatbelt first. If you've done the European path, you wanna turn the back of the car seat toward the door. That's gonna make it easier to get the seatbelt out. And now you can remove the baby from the vehicle. And when the seatbelt retracts all the way back in, it is going to reset back to normal. So it's not gonna be in locking mode anymore. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to follow the Pump Station and Nurturery on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook. All the details will be in the description below. See you in the next video.